Welcome back to another video, guys. My name is Corey. This is my channel, Corey Plays, and today we're doing some news. If you're new here, like a lot of people are, actually, we've hit 15,000 subscribers. Oh, wow. Uh, honestly, we just literally, just as I said that, hit 15,000 subscribers. I thought we were at like 14,990 something. But actually, we just hit 15,000 subscribers as I said that. So, yeah. Um, welcome to the channel. I've been doing Adventure Quest since I was at zero subscribers years ago. And today we hit 15,000. 15,000 individual people thought my videos were cool enough that they would want to subscribe to my channel. That's insane. Let's get into the video. This way all right i don't know why i always do that all right but reen's amendment are in charge at the moment because elena is gone <laughs> we have no news she's been gone since of september 1st the, literally the only news we have we have no news about any events i wanted to have news about the event but there was none so sorry about that uh she was at a family reunion with her husband so good stuff good stuff good stuff i know they're married because there was an event in game i'm not a creeper okay <laughs> first little bit of news we have days back at it with again with some naval this is not the new one this was a concept art. So Naval Commander, possible concept. A lot of people took this as this is what the in-game art was going to be. Which that'd be cool. That'd be a cool design for an in-game art actually. Like the like kind of like hand-drawn look to it sort of. A little bit. Not really though. Uh, but that looks really nice. And I like the face on it. I like, I, like, I like the face. But here's a newer version. A more in-game version if you, if you may. A lot less detail on it because this is a in progress piece of art as you can see so I'm doing this to show you the progression of it I know I could have just shown you the finished one first but after we have the concept which looks really nice we have the boom this is the finished not finished almost done this is the almost done art so he's probably just gonna clean it up a little bit add a little bit more detail maybe a little bit more shading or something into it but those swords look awesome. Not a fan of the skull hill, honestly. But I love the gradient on the blade. Looks very, very nice. And I love that there's a version without the cloak also. I don't know if that's an armor or a helmet uh, object. I should I'd probably reply and ask or read the replies. Let me read the replies real quick. Oh, we'll see. No, no response. So that could be an armor or it, it looks like it's not even attached to the helmet. So I guess that's an armor. So maybe there's an alt armor for it. So maybe you'd have to spend 2,200 ACs to get both uh, configurations. I honestly like the version without the cloak on it a bit more. Quite a bit more, actually. I love the design on the uh, on the shirt there. And uh, it doesn't really look like it's the shirt's together. But oh well, it's, it's a video game art. It's fine. I love the bandana. It's very detailed, very nice looking. Of course, it won't have the red outline in game. That's just something for the... Uh, for the display picture here and of course you can get the version of the helmet with the sword in the mouth i don't think he's finished the female versions of this arm yet or the uh the, the helmet i guess would be the only thing you have to swap the female and then the head on the uh, armor of course so i don't think that's finished yet but this does look pretty amazing so we'll see that in game in nine days from now so can't wait for that next up we have the enchanted Evolve Lightcaster and Evolve Lightcaster both, so I would guess that this one's the enchanted one, the top one, and then the bottom one would be the just normal evolved lightcaster. Uh these are a like a redo of the original lightcaster that was very popular and very nice looking armor. I wish I got it when it came out, but I didn't. So this one's coming back. This will be I think for Arnix's birthday. And yeah, it was confirmed to be ACs, so purchasable with ACs. And I also here have a more HD version of the armor. Here's the male version. Of course, I got the pictures off people's character pages because they were wearing the armor. So there's a more high resolution picture of it. Looks very nice, very detailed. And of course, the other version that Arnix confirmed right here does not have the 
bandages on the arms like this one does. So I also have a female version here. Here's the female version. Uh, it's got a sword on it. I guess that sword was unreleased, so it didn't show up on the character page when I looked at it. But uh, the basically the difference is it's thinner. I think they're showing some skin right there. I don't think they're showing skin on the other one. No, they are not. So you can see the difference is that they're not showing any skin. Um, of course, it's a lower cut like normal. Um, it's a little bit smaller in most areas like you would expect. Uh, that's about it for differences. Of course, the arms look different, smaller, of course. That's about it. Uh, I think the... I don't know why the female version's showing skin right there. That doesn't make a lot of sense when that one's solid on the male version, but... Oh well, that's how most of the female armors are in-game. I'm not gonna complain. So that's the Evolved Lightcaster, and I'm pretty sure that's all the news we have for today. Um, hopefully you enjoyed the video guys. If you did, drop a like down below. Remember there's still a giveaway going on on the channel. If you leave a comment, if you want to enter the giveaway, or just your opinions on the new, uh, the new art for the navel that Tage is putting out, or whether or not you're going to get the Lightcaster. And I'll see you guys all in the next video. I'm definitely getting all the navels and all the light casters that are coming out very soon. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. All right, it's been bothering me for a while and I'm throwing this in at the end of the news video because I just don't feel like this should be a separate video, but I kind of like doing this. I've done this a few times on my channel before if you ever watched, but I'm gonna decorate my house and fast forward. And then after, after you watch the fast forward clip, I will explain uh, why I put everything where it is. Okay, so this is my house right now. I think you can still get this house. I made a video like search how to get best house in Adventure Quest Worlds or something like that in YouTube if you want to find out how to get this house or to check my character page, of course, K0REY. So this is the house. It's got an armor customization station, uh, very nice effects on the outdoors with the snow and all that. And it's a very cool house. I like it a lot. And because when I stream and lots of people join my house all at once, it like deletes the items in my house. Don't ask me how that's a bug or a glitch or whatever, but it is, and that happens to me very often uh, when I stream. So we're gonna redecorate the house because I've had no decorations in the house for a long time. So let's get to it. All right, so I finished decorating my house. The outside is basically the same as always been. I got the mulligans. Uh, I don't know. It just looks very, very nice outside. Um, all right, so it looks very nice outside. Hey, Strife. And on the inside, I can click on this to get a quest for the weed of the bacon, and it's cool and animated. So everything in this room is basically gold. I got. I don't know where I even got that chest. I just had it in my house inventory, so I figured, hey, it'll look cool beside a pile of pigs that are golden, and put the golden statue right there, and the cake behind the thing, so that adds a little bit of a like a little bit of depth to the room, a little bit more depth to the room, of course. And then I'm hiding the arrow under the mat, which I like doing. I did that with the uh, Doge outside also, and I I don't know why the Doge and the pumpkin and the rest of the stuff so Christmas themed. Don't don't ask. All right, so this room, a little bit more hardcore than the rest. Although even in this corner, is the singing mulligan, the sleeping baby dragon, which I thought was pretty cute. Uh, I did that in the other room before, <laughs> so it doesn't really make sense that there's a sleeping baby dragon with the rock band and the guy crafting weapons in this room, like super hardcore. I really like this. It's probably my favorite house item. Uh, you get to sell a treasure chest, of course, and if you click on it, you can do a quest for 
the Cadabra Oaks that are in my bank currently because they're free AC items. Well, not free AC items. We need Legion tokens and stuff, but they're AC items you can get that you can store in your bank for free. So I got those. Uh, it's really cool. I love the uh, I love the middle, how bright it is. I can appreciate that. I've done a, done some work on some photos before, and that's a pretty cool effect. I like that. And, of course, you can armor customize still. That button isn't blocked, although I think it's... Yeah, no. Okay, that's fine. You can still click on that. So, and it's kind of covering the background where the, there was like a mirror and stuff there back there. So I just kind of covered that with him. And I can also click on this guy to get quests too. I'm pretty sure he's rare now. I think that was for Dej's birthday a year or two ago. So that's the house. I really like my house now. Um, this room lags a lot more. Of course, it's really nice when you don't have items so you don't lag. This room's pretty okay with lag. Once I get people in here in a stream or something, this house is going to be insanely laggy right now considering... Except for the outdoors. I, I try to keep this place a little pretty, pretty much lag free because it's where I'll spend most of the time in the houses in the first room. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the video today. If you did, I already said all this stuff, but leave a like and all that. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys all in the next one. Peace. Click the video in the top right corner if you haven't seen it yet, and I'll see you all in the next one. Why do I always do this intro? Welcome back to another video.